Hi everybody, here's another water comparison video. Tonight we're comparing two premium high pH waters that both look pretty promising. They both look like pretty good quality waters. This should be a good episode. First up is Jackson Springs Premium Spring Water. Next up is Antioxidant High pH Alkazone Water. This Alkazone Water was from like a health food store and this was $2.49. This claims to have a pH level of 9.5. That's a very high pH level. This says it has 35 milligrams of potassium. This says it also has magnesium, zinc, and calcium. I paid $2.49 for this. This is also sold at walmart.com. If you buy a 12 pack on walmart.com, it's $36. So it's actually more expensive from Walmart than where I got it from, because that's $3 per bottle. This also has selenium. It has 15% of your daily needs of selenium which selenium is an antioxidant, which is naturally occurring in soil. And a neat thing about this bottle is that they have uh, the hidden text. If you look through the water, you can see more information about the water and just like hidden text. Because, you know, water is transparent and the bottle is transparent. Why not just add some extra stuff in there? This is from Hackensack, New Jersey. And this water has been around since 1994. The Jackson Springs water is from Manitoba, Canada, and this is $10 per bottle. This is one of the most expensive waters I've ever had. This is from salaciousdrinks.com. The best part of this water, the thing I'm most excited about, is this was awarded the prestigious Berkeley Spring International Water Tasting Gold Medal. You can see the gold medal right here. It's actually shiny and reflective and gold medal. The gold medal is for it being the, quote, best tasting water in the world. And this water is sourced from a private natural aquifer in Canada, and it's naturally filtered through rocky Canadian terrain. This says it has a pH level of 8.1. So let's open these up and do a taste test. This is a plastic bottle. I kind of was hoping it would be, you know, glass. Since, it's, since this is $10, was kind of hoping for that and it's like not even that great quality plastic either it's, it's really like kind of thin plastic um a lot of people in the reviews i saw for this were really complimenting the bottle i think it's kind of cheap in a way but um everybody agrees the water for this is really good these two could easily make it to around three or four like these both look really good so let's taste them here we go Wow, it's good quality. This does have 239 uh, TDS, total dissolved solids. Uh, you, can, you can taste the, uh, the mineral content of it. It's a good water, it's a really good one. It says it has no fluoride, which is also a positive for me. I don't, I'm not a big fan of fluoride. You can't taste the difference with, with no fluoride, but um, I'm just not a fan of it. Alkazone water, no smell. Wow, there's a difference between these two. This is like a sweeter, like almost a fruity taste to it. I think it's the, the magnesium in it. Yeah, this is another example where if somebody tells you that all water is the same, have them go back and forth between these two because there's a clear difference in the taste. This is like an earthy, you know, an earthy, soily taste. This is like a fruity taste. Let's test out the pH levels. Here we go. Okay, here's the results of the pH test. What do you guys think? Do you think the colors match up with the advertised pH level? Yeah, a definite like earthy taste to it, like a soily, mild soil taste to it. This is almost like a fruit punch, like a, almost a mild Kool-Aid. Oh yeah! Taste to it. In all the advertising for this, it's a very premium, very high quality brand. They show people in like tuxedos and dresses drinking this, like out of, you know, wine glasses, like all premium stuff. That's how the bottle is supposed to look also. A quote from Martin Rees. The, the famous water reviewer, he says that this is a very good water and an incredibly good bottle. I agree with the taste of the water. It is a very good tasting water, but I don't think the bottle is 
incredibly good. I don't know, it's just, it's plastic. If you don't know who Martin Reese is, he's a water taster. He's been doing it longer than I have. He has a whole YouTube channel that he started before mine even. That's what he says about this water. So I'm gonna say that the winner is this one, Jackson Springs water. And it's moving on in the next round and I'm not going to finish it because I don't wanna spend another $10 for round two. So I'm gonna save the rest of this for round two. And I'm gonna finish this now. That is good water. This Alcazone water actually has a very similar taste to the Alcame water that I reviewed about a thousand episodes ago with a very like fruity flavor to it. It's like very similar to the Alcame water, like almost identical. And this is eliminated though. I'm going with this one. So thanks for watching everyone.